The Lamont School District is taking steps toward providing speech training for students in special education. After facing a shortage of speech pathologists across the county, the Kern County Superintendent of Schools is collaborating with the district to offer a service. Eyewitness News reporter Mary Peronian explains. Parents at the Lamont School District are working to get four out of the five board members ousted, but their main concern is the lack of hiring speech pathologists for the special education program to help with the area of speech. But Superintendent Lori Gonzalez says they are working to solve this problem. It's a, not just a, a challenge here in Lamont. It's a, it's a county, it's a state, it's a national challenge. Earlier this year, the Kern County Superintendent of Schools sent a letter to school district superintendents addressing the challenges they face having qualified speech pathologists to meet the needs of students. The superintendent of schools said they have contracted with a vendor for teletherapy, which will be supported by trained speech aides. But Kern County isn't the only area having a hard time finding qualified applicants. Schools across the country are struggling to fill their openings for speech pathologists as well. Last week, Eyewitness News spoke to a Lamont School District parent who believes the district removed a teacher because she spoke out about issues, including this. They don't have a speech therapy in person, you know, everything in Zoom and then things like that. And then, yes, and then close to the people, there are people to help clean and they're very short and all that stuff. And that's why she's fighting for, because she was the best for the, for the kids. Superintendent Lori Gonzalez said the idea to do teletherapy all started during COVID-19, which was when schools transitioned to virtual learning. She said online learning has its positive outcomes, no matter the age. My director of special ed learned a lot during that time as well. So she's created a very different look in, in how our students are, are getting their services. A lot of people believe that you put a laptop in front of them and you walk away. That is not what it looks like. We have a huge Prometheum board where the teletherapist is in front of the students. The students are then looking at the, the SLP via the, the Prometheum board. She is watching them as they are projected to her. With our preschoolers, we have our parents attending. So not only are our students getting the benefit of the teletherapy, but we have our parents that are there watching how to go home now and actually use those same um, you know, strategies that they're using to teach them and how to produce the language. Gonzalez said students will continue to receive what they need regardless of what is going on. Reporting from Lamont, Mary Pronian, Eyewitness News.